Okay, I start off saying that yes, I am very happy to be back in the national team and the camp. I think girls are doing great and it's really a pleasure to be back. Okay, we start with passing, pass and move, pass and move here and there, both side. Then we go 6 6. Women's football should be given a kind of equal opportunity, and that's what Federation is doing now. I think the girls are getting more of camps, trips, tournaments, exposures, and really, I think the future, the girls will do a good job. Every coach wants to win the title, and the team wants to win the titles. Girls will, like, if you ask any staff, they will say the same. But I'm telling you, we are really working hard towards that. We respect. All, all the opponents who we will play versus, yeah, Bangladesh is a host, Nepal is, you know, coming in, Bhutan is there. Uh, we will respect them, but yes, on a match day, we will give our best. We will not see who the team is. Playing versus the top countries in the big tournament, that's it. That itself is a kind of a, you know, booster for the girls playing more matches. Girls have been, you know, exposed to a top level tournament. I think it's great. It's great for the girls and yes, I definitely say women's football in India is growing because I was part of the national team when I was playing and now I'm part of the national team as a coach. There is a lot, lot, lot and the, you know, the big step ahead for the women's game. Earlier, if you see, we had only girls lined up from Manipur but now the time and the culture and the education part is changing. We have girls from different parts of this country name like states like Gujarat girls are coming in so you can imagine there's no portals in any state back when they worked out but it's really good to be with the girls when they give 100% on pitch no excuses in any ways you know they have to give 100% and I think if everybody puts in their hand together we will surely come back smiling so waiting for that <laughs>